thank you for staying with me here on Just Nigeria from the BBC and Channels Television. I am Wali Fakile. Coming up, the social innovative entrepreneur promoting STEM education in Nigeria. But before that, now it's safe to say African men are investing more money in their appearance. The male grooming product market on the continent is growing along with a rise worldwide in the number of men going for treatments at beauty salons. In our next story, Sadin Ali on Jigo went to Dakar to find out how this is unfolding. When his clip on his skincare routine got thousands of clicks, Sidi Aydarag became convinced of the growing interest in the topic of male grooming in Senegal. When you take care of yourself, you have more self-confidence. When you have more self-confidence, you automatically have more charisma. I think the most important thing about manhood is charisma. It's that when you're in a space, that people feel you are there. It's a short step from taking men's beauty care advice on the internet to going in the hands of professional. Merci beaucoup. Men's favorite is facial. When we receive men, we ask them about their budget for their skincare routine. The answer that comes most naturally is, I have no limit if I can achieve my goals. Here we go for my first facial in a beauty salon. So, uh, did you expect such an enthusiasm here in, in Senegal among men? Uh, Things are changing. Men need and demand more and more this type of care. And it's not just in beauty salons. Javid Kamal is a popular barber in Dakar. He has been in the business for over 20 years, but sees it changing. There are men who can spend more for an extra like facial, a manicure, a pedicure plus hairdressing. But it's between 2,000 and 25,000 CFA francs. So what do men on the streets of Dakar think about personal grooming? I think you have to be natural. You don't need to go to beauty salons to make yourself more handsome. It's my wife who takes care of my skin. I don't have time to go to beauty salons. And what do the women think? I think it's a good thing for men. I think it's good that men go to beauty salons and take care of their skin. Appearance is said to be a reflection of our well-being. And whatever your view on male grooming, African men seem increasingly willing to pay to look good. Well, everyone, regardless of gender, should look good. You'd agree with me.